guys, it's Esther Crafter. Okay, um, oh my gosh, I don't know that I can make it, but I will try. I will give it a try. <laughs> okay, Donna have been requested for me for the Porsche swing. Um, you know, I, I did... I did post it on my Facebook that what I have in my that that it guys that it you guys suggest me to look on Pinterest and somewhere else, I don't know where to look it ladies I, I couldn't find anybody who make those things yet so I suppose I have to you know give it a first time try I will try my best to make it uh, and I don't know where my sin went. I think I have the whole rose. But anyway, um, so um, I, I still don't know how I, how big my cursive ball, nah, la a rectangle my cursive ball. Um, I cut this pieces seven and a quarter by three and a half. Is this one gonna be the sheer? I gonna build the sheer first. So, um, got this one it inside the casibo, so we ha I have to make this one first because if you want to make mini album to sit on the chair, so that you have to considering about the chair, if you build a casibo first and then you build a chair later and now you have to like squid everything because you already build up your casibo. Anyway, um. So I cut, as I said, I cut this one seven and quarter by three and have two pieces. Um, this one is just, it, I just want to lay it together so that it gets like a tougher. You can use any uh, like a uh, shipboard thick. I don't, I don't care whatever you use. It. I just want to use the cardboard because you know recycling. You can use anything you want. It's I just. It's my idea, so you don't have to follow what whatever I do. It's just you know, just give you some idea. So I'm gonna glue this piece together, or you can if you find the cardboard that's already thick. You know, you I do have the thick cardboard, but you know what, guys, really hard to cut. So I use the this side and I here two pieces together there this one gonna be the, sh the bottom of the shear right so now we have to um, and now I'm considering should I use the backing or just punch this thing you know like uh, you make like a swing you know what I mean you don't have to build the backing now that another idea that I like it you know when um maybe I should do that for Cody like um the swing you know like a little here and then have the chin and makes um the stand like make oh that a good idea after this I gonna build that thing for my craft room for this way <laughs> now you never know what I have crazy idea huh. Okay, um, no, too much talking here. It's gonna be a long video again, sorry ladies. Sometimes when I have some idea, I carry away and when I have an idea, I want to do it immediately. If I don't do it, you know what, it get lazy for me. I, I don't want to do this. Now, okay, now I'm going to make a backing of this year, so... How tall is it gonna be? Where my ruler? So this ruler I didn't buy it. My husband I stole it from him. So um, how high is that? Maybe three and a half. Yeah, same as this. So seven and a. Quarter. Seven and a quarter by three and a half and okay.
I'm not sure this uh, the, the back of the chair is too high enough, but we'll see if it's too high. I always can trim it up. That if we not, you know, I'll try to cover with anything yet. I'm not going to make a, like a straight like this or oh, I don't know depend on the the armchair here that how am I going to build it so uh, I have no idea what I'm doing but I'll try my best guy never keep up without trying my slogan or my quote that what we call here in my country we call slogan but here you call quote right never keep up with, never keep up without trying okay if you never try how do you know that you can make or cannot make it right so I think I'm gonna lay this one like that angle So okay, um, hmm, the armchair I will go up half of this one. So this one what? Three and a half. Uh, the armchair go um two inches. So now go up at two inches, right? I have anything to be on my casebook or at least I haven't prepared anything. Anyway, um, I'm trying not to sell complain too much here. <laughs> Did I sell complain too much, ladies? Uh, one inches. Okay, I can mark. Here, okay, you can see this here. One inch there. So from this part is what three and a half should be like um, four and a half. To, so this this bit four and a half. here I can see right you can see that and then just cut it off see here be the arm shape there and then this one here We do the same thing with this uh, another armchair there. Or you can just trade it. See that? Light that one up and... 
and uh, this video how many view again gonna be an armchair there of the other one so this one see that you think this chair too big well, I just worry you're not gonna have enough space to um, sit on if you want to make a mini album inside. That's what I'm worried about. So, and now I'm still thinking I can uh, use the paper or what? Not sure yet. Mm, I'm going to. So I'm going to adhere this one first to adhere this side first with my hot glue there This a little bit too short and this one this one should be a little bit longer. This is okay. I think I'm going to use the some of the paper to cover there the corner.
just a couple of dead ends. guys I'm not sure that what I'm going to do to cover with my trim the rosette trim or the cover paper I'm not sure yet but from first I want to I just just in case you know I just want to paint in in color paint any ink you know so confusing what I mean I'm you know if you change your mind later you already you know if you not paint it gonna be the problem so what I'm going to do that I'm going to paint the whole thing in black first if I don't like it I just you know cover with the lace or paper or the trim if the, I'm not sure that I can cover um, the lace over the paint or just the cover with the paper I'm not sure so I'm going to use my black acrylic paint here that gonna paint the whole thing in black when I started in black that means I'm going for winter style huh 